Hey, what is up, guys? It's your boy Alpha Babanovi, and welcome back to the channel. Now, this is a series that I was gonna start a while back, but I never did. Um, I think it's time for me to start a series like that. Dark Souls Three is what, like three months around the corner. So I think it's gonna be, it's gonna make for a good, fun series, and I'm gonna show you guys. I mean, I'm gonna tell you guys what kind of series it is. Um, basically. I'm gonna do in death PvP. I'm gonna narrate the fights that I'm having. I'm gonna try to call out what the what my enemy is trying to do. Obviously, you guys know I'm gonna cut out the downtime, and we should have a good time. And you guys should learn a lot from this. Hopefully, that's that's my um that's my goal. My goal because I have had many people request um for me to do like tutorials of how to PvP and things like that. Um, but. Uh, I, I don't know. I never did them. I never did like tutorials. Um, I, I guess because um, let me load this character and I'll, I'll talk to you guys once this loads. All right. So my character has loaded. Um, I actually wasn't trying to load this character because I wanted it to be a forest hunter. But since I loaded this character, we are going to invade the forest. I mean, we are going to host the forest. Let me see. Why do I have Dung Pie here? I'm pretty sure there's a reason that I have Dung Pie. Oh, because I don't have. I, I do have Prime Stones. Um, what am I missing here? I'm missing. What do I put here? Oh, Green Blossoms. I'm I'm missing Green Blossoms. So I'm gonna go pick up some Green Blossoms real quick, and then I'll see you guys in a bit once I come back from picking up the Green Blossoms because. Yeah, I don't want to waste anyone's time, and I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, guys, since I came to buy Prime Stones here at the Bergs from the lady in the sewers, from the NPC in the sewers, I thought we'd stay here for a little bit, and um, I'll show you guys my build right now. Just let me turn human so we can go outside and um, get some invasions. I have the boss alive, so that's not a problem. And we should have a lot of fun with this series. Um, one thing I am going to say, though, I'm planning on making like two or three videos a week um, of this series. But if you guys really really like the series, show me with a like and I will like definitely make more videos and if like the the series doesn't get that many views, it doesn't get that many likes. I never like I never ask for likes because I just don't like doing that. But um for this series I will. I, I guess I'm gonna mention it in every video to like like the video and all that kinds of stuff. Share it if you can. Um as you guys know, you guys gotta kill all these people. I need to still go buy some stuff. Um, yeah, so like the series. I mean if you like this series go ahead and like it um, If you like the format and everything um, I think it's gonna be a very very helpful series for all of you guys um, That are trying to learn they are trying to take it to the next level that um, are, are trying to learn the game mechanics and all that because I'm gonna be narrating the fight I'm gonna be narrating everything you guys will see um, And I, I don't know maybe I'll stay at the, at the birds this whole time. Uh, let me see if I'm getting no, I'm not getting invaded so we'll hit the red eyes um Oh, let me show you guys the build real quick. Now we're getting invaded. While this guy gets summoned, uh, while this guy um, invades me. So, I'm still level 135. You guys are going to ask yourself, why the fuck do you have 74 vitality if it caps at 45? Okay, that is pretty simple because I want to flip. Um, I want to use Hornet and I want to flip on this build. So, I want to use Hornet and I want to flip in this build. Um, and this is all the armor that I can wear besides all other stuff. Okay, so here's our first invasion. We first, you first, the first thing you gotta do in the invasion is look at your opponent's bill. He has a sight. He has, uh, he has, um, what is it called? Uh, Dust Crown. So we know he has one. We know he's gonna buff with Dark Moon Blade probably or Sunlight Blade that, that sight or maybe not. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Flipping is really important when you fight this kind of people. Okay, there he was coming. We're going for a backstab right away. We're going to spam a little bit. I was going for a stun to BS. There, there's the Wong. There's the Wong. Okay, nothing happened there. He's going to do a running attack. We're going to flip to his back and we're going to get that backstab. Um, I'm sorry. I got to get better at doing this. Um, yeah, you're going to get fucking destroyed. There you go. I'm running, I'm running R1 with the Rapier did it. That's our first match. Uh, I'm going to get better at narrating the fights. I'm pretty good at it already. But um, in the heat of the moment, um, sometimes I probably not narrate the right way. Or I'm not going to narrate the way, the, what I'm trying to do. Things like that. So I, I need to work on it. I need to work on it a little bit. Um, let me show you guys the bill again. So you guys have an idea. By the way, every single time that I fight in Dark Souls... I start breathing hard. I don't. It's like I'm not. 
it's it's weird okay it's weird it's like i don't breathe as i'm fighting and when the fight is done i i fucking like <sighs> it's like i'm fucking actually fighting in real life i don't know why i'm like that i i just really get into it that's why i love dark Souls. so anyways so we have 74 vitality i already told you guys why i have 74 vitality that's because i want to flip um with this bill so i don't have fat ring and this bill i'm constantly struggling with my endurance and uh eight attunements i didn't touch that i would love to have 10 so i can have um one casting of um part within i have 36 endurance which is nothing it's no endurance at all 30 strength and 40 dex and that's pretty much it that's 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 it because this is a bandit class i always start with a bandit class let me show you guys the armor i really don't have that many options of armor because i'll fat roll with them let me hit the dry fingers so i can get invaded let me hit this eyes yeah we'll try to invade too um invading at the bergs is a hit and miss because a lot of times you invade high level hosts and it's a pain in the dick because you're going like you're one so you're solo 135 going against the host that can use fucking literally everything because they're like high level they're like max level or just really really high level and they can like literally use ev everything and anything they'll use the moonlight gray sword they'll use artorias or the obese sword they, they they can use everything and they they pack some serious hp okay um here's the consumables that i use um sm flask obviously because i'm hosting if i wasn't hosting i wouldn't have the sm flask here i will have humanity because then I'm, that means i'm invading um green blossoms which are really fucking important uh, i recommend everybody to use green blossoms i know that a lot of japanese players don't use them but uh, i think they don't use them because they're lazy they're like too lazy to go buy them it doesn't take that long here we have our next match what is he wearing uh we have a golden tracer i'm gonna die here i think this is a hacker uh golden tracer is bad i need to heal real quick yeah golden tracer is, is not good you gotta try to parry it uh try to parry or go for backstabs i'm trying to set him up for a parry yeah like i'm trying to like just see he's gonna come and spam right now no okay i'm gonna go back so he got a maracumo we went for the backstab he is hacking indeed he's a hacker he's a hacker um look at his hp and look at the damage i did i'm gonna try to fight him obviously i'm gonna lose but we'll try to kill him um obviously i went for the parry there because that's the easiest way to kill these people i'm gonna go for the chain oh no he's fucking he's panicking yeah um this is what you get <laughs> <laughs> it's embarrassing i, I really want, don't want to like i don't want to promote this kind of fucking players but i mean he's eventually going to kill me he's going to keep flipping and healing he wants to heal now mm, he trapped me i'm gonna go in for a great sword if i can fucking get it in time come near me you asshole he already healed again god damn it we're gonna go in for fucking big numbers we're gonna use a club on his ass and see what we could do uh, that went for that was a trade. Yeah, this is this is pretty much what you get on Dark Souls now. I got one shot it. He's max level probably with a claymore. So good. Um, yeah, we're gonna block him. Uh, I could block him or I could leave from here. I don't know. This is what left to Dark Souls though. This is this is like this is your norm. This is like the normal PvP. Anyways, I'm going to go to the forest. I'm not going to sit here and block him. I'll take too long. I'll just go to the forest and um, we have a match over there. Um, so I'll see you guys All in a right, bit. guys. Welcome back. Here I am at the forest. I left from over there because I didn't feel like blocking him. Sometimes your PS3 freezes when you try to block people. At least mine does. It's really annoying and inconvenience, actually. But um, that's, that's, the, that's Dark Souls for you now. This is Dark Souls. This game is like this game is pretty much dead. Um, it's a lot of hackers. I have a, my, my, my block list is full um so i'm gonna show you guys what to do here if you want to host the forest especially if you want to host it by yourself you gotta run in there real fast and kill all the forest hunters put on the fog ring for more effectiveness for more like for the for more um fastest kills so that way not all the forest hunters rush you at the same time and you can just kill one one at a time you can take your time you know the wizard you can always backstab his ass or if he's acting like a dick that he does this like 360 turn Okay, I couldn't get to his back, so I just kill him normal. You gotta be fast to kill the forest hunters. 
um because there's certain times in the day or the night where the the forest is, is really busy there's a lot of people playing even though the game is dying there's still a lot of people that play eh? um so you gotta be fast at killing them this is the most annoying guy that guy was the the, the ninja is the most annoying to want to kill i'm not gonna summon a phantom by the way because that, that's gonna be the purpose later on in the series i will summon phantoms and things like that um for now though i'm not gonna summon anybody i'm gonna just um, i'm gonna be in here by myself uh, most likely I'm gonna die. This is where I get my cool clips, but uh, uh, there's a lot of dying involved That you can roll BS this guy And now we change the ring. I'll show you guys my consumables. This is the first video of the series by the way guys So as the series goes, I am going to improve on everything um, Especially that I haven't done any live commentaries in a very long time um, We'll refresh. We'll hit the dry fingers. Um, the dry fingers are really important for you to host because it refreshes your internet, it, it, it tells the it tells the server that you're ready for your next invasion. Um, I think they do that for you to like don't get overwhelmed. Um, I don't know if you guys know, but for each invasion, like after you die, it's like five minutes refresh time. So if I die right now, it, not in the forest, in the forest that doesn't apply. Anywhere else in the birds, anywhere it, that that applies. When you die, there's a five minutes refresh time. Like nobody can invade you within five minutes unless. It's pillar noob unless you freaking have um unless you have the dry fingers and you hit the dry fingers and then i refresh your internet it, it you don't you don't really need the dry fingers you can also do it with crack red eye um but the dry fingers is, is the, the the one that works the most i was going to show you guys my consumable uh the consumables i'm using so sm flask because i'm hosting green blossoms um, prime stones because I like to throw one after I kill someone just to keep track of how many kills I have gotten and things like that and then the firekeeper soul to heal myself or to get more humanity and then the dry fingers we are rocking a rapier a marakumo but the marakumo is like I can switch this at any time when I get back stuff I can switch it on the fly and the darken I like the darken but the darken is really shitty it's, it's the sh like shittiest shield that you can have but it looks cool because it looks like you don't have a shield, but you actually do. It's just really shitty. <laughs> it's just a really crappy shield. Now, the setup, how I have this. This, I have it like this because, uh, see, when I have someone on low HP or when I have a Turo, I can go from here. I can go to here. I can go to the freaking, if I have you on low HP, I can go to the um, spear. I don't use the spear though more that, anymore that often because it's kind of cheap. Like, especially when I have your no HP and then using a spear, then I have the gray sword. You guys know I use the gray sword. Pretty much all these weapons that I have here, um, especially these two, are like for the fly. It's like for if I'm getting backstab, if I'm getting parry, I can go to them. Then the rings, I have the rings set up a, a certain way. I, I've i been having this ring since I used to invade the forest because you'll put the cat ring on. And then when you're invading, you'll go to the hornet ring. But since in this build, I flip and i have hornet because i have like a shitload of hp just because i want to flip and have hornet um i have a, I, I have this equipped because I, and especially i'm ganking i don't i'm not using the cat ring so i can switch the flipping ring to the wolf ring to the i can i can switch it to um the red tear stone ring or i can switch it to havos the armor now that's a hit and miss because i can only wear on this build though only on this build and any build that I can flip and horn it, um, I cannot wear anything. I can wear that that I what I have on, or I could wear this, and that's pretty much GG. You don't want I, I can wear dust things like I can I can be dusk, but in Dark Souls when people see you that you have dusk armor on, they're gonna get a golden tracer because the, it, dusk is the easiest to like you can bleed. Um, dusk armor is really shitty. That's what I'm trying to get at um so yeah so i could be dusk i mean i don't have a problem being dusk but it's, it's just a really shitty armor and it gets like people can just bleed you really easy and i don't know i don't like it because as soon as they see that you have dusk armor like you can literally get bleed they can kill you within three shots um that's not a dusk armor by the way um where is it hello um i'm explaining so there's not a lot of action right now because i'm explaining how the series is going to work uh but i'm pretty sure in the next couple of episodes like the next episodes that i make uh it's going to be more and more action uh because that's the whole point right there, here we have an invader let me see where he is he doesn't look like he's too okay this person see i should take dusk off this guy has dark beats oh i'm gonna backstab him yep i'm gonna backstab him i did a running r1 and he panicked and i'm gonna train him 
I'm gonna chain him. Oh no, he's gonna try running. Or oh, he's gonna turn around and beat. Oh, there you go. I got him. That was an accidental backstab, by the way. Um, like I was saying, guys, if you really enjoy this series or if you really enjoy this kind of videos, go ahead and like it. I know I'm all over the place right now because I'm trying to explain how the series is gonna work. I'm trying to explain to you guys the how the weapons I have. I'm trying to explain the build I'm using, which I'm gonna do the same thing in every in every video probably. So I'm, expect me to be all over the place. Um, and I'm, I guess I'm over talking. So I mean, you guys get the point. I, 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 I think you guys get it, right? You guys get how the series is gonna work. Um, I'm gonna take Dusk Armor off because I don't want to get one shotted um, or two shotted by like a golden tracer. We're just gonna wear this. Here we have our, our next fight. Where I should be hitting the dry fingers. You gotta be hitting the dry fingers constantly. Okay, let's go meet up this guy. This will probably be my last fight, guys. I'm just introducing the series here. Um, or I'll probably have another couple of fights. Let me see. What are you doing? He's, see, he's gonna back into the trees. Um, a lot of people do that. Or maybe not. Let me see. I'm gonna set him up for a parry. That was almost a parry. This is a parry. This is a parry. He's gonna do a running around one. Nope. I'm gonna backstab him then. If he does that running around one again, I'm gonna parry his ass. I'm gonna backstab him. Oh, I didn't get there in time. All right. Running around one. Oh, that should have been a parry. He's gonna keep doing those back steps to running to R1. I'm gonna. Okay, I killed him. There we go. Running around once. Um. It's pretty common sense what I'm trying to do, but I'm still going to try to narrate it as the best of my analogy, as best as I can. Um, like I said, I should get better and better and better at the series. Um, I never had a series like this on Dark Souls 2. I think I did some live commentary, but only like two times. That's pretty much it. Um, so I'll see you guys in a bit. We're going to wait for a couple of more invasions and then we're going to call it a day. Like I said, and I know I keep saying this. If you like this kind of videos, if you want the series to continue, if you want like more than three videos or two videos a week, like it. Because you guys want to know that when you, even though I don't like, I don't ask for likes, but it tells me that you guys like this kind of videos. It, it lets me know that you guys are enjoying these videos and you guys want more. That That's like, that's a way of you guys telling me, Alpha, we want more of these videos. These videos are good. Um, we need more by liking the video. It doesn't take that long. Um, I'm gonna try not to mention that again because um, yeah, I don't know. I, I just don't like to ask for likes. Never been like that. Uh, let me see. What do we have here? Habbles. What What do you have? Oh no, he has an axe. I think there's a lot of people that invade you running our one, and then we're gonna go to a backstab. Um, he just stood there. I don't know why. And we're gonna chain him because that's how that's how PVP is at the forest. Why are you running? Why are you running? What are you doing? He was trying to heal or eat a fucking divine blessing. One of those two. Someone else invading me, as you guys can see, the forest is pretty busy. EM invading. We vanquish um, Mertex murder, some shit like that. I don't know how to read that well. My reading fucking sucks. Where is this guy coming from? I think he's coming from right here. So, after this fight, I am going to call it a day, guys. And, I, I w okay, he's running to the fucking trees. There's a lot of people that do that. And that's okay, though, because it's my job to go. Where are you going? This is another Havel guy. Another backstab. Let me see how much HP has a lot of HP. I'm gonna try to chain him. I should try to get a parry for you guys, but I got a backstab. This is the Mita, okay? This is Dark Souls Mita. Um A lot of people ask why I use Hornet all the time, but this is the Mita. Everybody fucking uses Hornet. It, it's, it's if you don't if you complain about the Hornet ring and chaining people, you obviously haven't played Dark Souls enough. Um you obviously haven't played it a, a lot, like I have. Anyways, guys, I don't want this video to be too long because this is the first one and I don't know how you guys are going to like this kind of format. Again, I keep saying it. Like the video if you really enjoyed it. And tomorrow, maybe not tomorrow, I want to see how this video does or maybe tomorrow, I don't know. I'm random like that. Tomorrow or the day after, I will see how the video is doing and I will like, I don't know. I will let you, I will, I, uh, if I can talk, I'm going to let you guys know if I'm going to make one video a day. I mean, one video per week, two videos per week, three videos per week. My goal is that when Dark Souls 3 comes out, to make at least four or five videos a week. Like, one one every day, one every day. Maybe one not on Sunday, because Sunday is like I spend time with my family. We go out and eat and all that. But that's my idea, though. So, this is why I want to start the series, so I can get good at the commentating, good at narrating the fights, and give you guys some good tips and tricks when Dark Souls 3 comes out. Like, do some live commentaries. Um, anyways, guys. 
as always you guys do take care don't forget to like the video if you like this kind of format like i said and alpha baba no we shall see y'all on the next one bye guys take care